We saw a globular object approximately five miles ahead of us. At first, the frontal cross-section area of this object was so small that I thought it was an aircraft with a highly swept-backed wing. But as it got closer to us and below us, it was obvious that it had no wings at all. And I then considered it to be a meteorological balloon. Um, after it passed us by, from first to last sight was approximately 10 seconds, and it then occurred to me that the speed of closing was so great that it couldn't possibly be a free balloon. Um, I have no idea what it could be, and I passed the report to London Airways. How big was the object? Well, it's very difficult to assess the size of any object while flying. Um, all I can say, the closest I can get to it, is that it was smaller than a Viscount. Was it traveling at any great speed? Uh, well, the closing speed of both the object and my own aircraft was up in the region of a thousand miles an hour, which means that the object itself must have been in, uh, doing at least six to seven hundred miles an hour. Were there any windows in it? Not to my knowledge, no. Was it powered in any way? Well, it must have been powered. Um, a free balloon would only, we would only approach it at the speed of our own aircraft, which is 300 miles an hour. So it must have been powered. The speed of closing was too much too great for it to be a free balloon. Did anybody else witness the object? Yes, first off, some Murphy, my co-pilot.